So, you're looking to build something in the county? To do that, you need a permit. In the past, that meant a trip to the government center, which let's face it, it's not always convenient. Nope. However, now you can go through the entire process at your desk, in your living room, or anywhere on your mobile device. Introducing the ePermit Center, a way to submit your application, review your application for comments, pay for your permit, and you can print it out. Here's how it works. First, go to adcogov.org and under the heading Save a Trip, click on ePermit Center. Then you'll create a login. All you need is an email address. Once you've logged in, click Create an Application. Once you've agreed to the terms and conditions, you can specify what you're building. It could be something as elaborate as a new home or as small as a new fence. Or it could be a replacement of an old item like a furnace or an air conditioner or even a re-roof. No matter the size of the project or the nature, if you see it on this list, you need a permit. Once you've specified what your project is, now it's time to enter in some specifics about your project. What's the address? Make sure to only enter your street number and then press search. It makes it a lot easier to find your address in our database. Once you enter your street number, a list of addresses will appear on the screen. Select the one corresponding to your project. You will then be brought back to a page which allows you to review the project details again before continuing. You will then insert details and description of your project, including that estimated value. attach the submittal items, the plans or documents for your specific project in PDF format. Once that's done, you have one more chance to review the details of your project. Once you've reviewed and make sure details are correct, it's time to pay the review fee. Remember, all your personal credit card info will be kept strictly private. Once your payment is submitted, you will receive a confirmation email. Then, county staff will review the application for completeness. Once it's deemed complete, your permit goes in for review. This process can take about 10 days, but during that time, you can always log in and check for updates. As long as there's no need for changes to your plans, it will then be approved. Then you can pay the final permit fee, print your permit at home or the office, and you're free to go ahead and start on your project. If you have any questions about the ePermit Center, feel free to contact the Community and Economic Development Department